Hey everybody, welcome to CR Anti Designers. This is Chetan, and now let's get started. To make a model, you need to add a cylinder, and we will go with the eight words. Then rotate this cylinder into the 90 degree, and then scale it along the x-axis like this. Then go to the edit mode, select these words, right click connect vertex path and same thing here. After that you need to select this bottom faces and you need to delete them. So select the faces and press X to delete them. After that you need to select this face and you need to scale them. But change the transform orientation to the 3D cursor and then scale it like this. And then you can add one loop cut like this means words and then select the words right click connect word x path. Same thing do here. Add a words and then connect these words. And create a path in between these words. Then select that bottom edge and E to extrude it and then scale it along the x and y axis. And just adjust the scale. And try to keep the same distance in between these edge loops. Then select this edge and E to extrude it and move it along the Y axis. Change the transform orientation to the individual and E to extrude it and move these edges along the X axis. And then select this edge loop and then press S, Y and 0. Give the value 0 to make it straight. And same thing. And then you need to take the symmetry along the Y axis. So just take the symmetry along the Y axis you will get this kind of object just adjust the position of these edges and then you need to add the loop cuts like this and then select the words right click connect to vertex path and try to create that loop structure take the symmetry along the y axis and then select these edges and control x to dissolve them Then add one loop cut here and then add one loop cut here and then add one loop cut like this and use the edge slide to give its right position. Then you can add the sub D modifier and shear smooth it, increase it count up to 2 and you will get this kind of mesh. Add an SSL loop cuts if you want and then use the set flow. You can take the 12 words or 16 word cylinder at the initial stage also or you can use the edge flow like this. And then select these words and use the edge slide to give the right position to them. And then take the symmetry along the y axis. And now it's look good. And here I want to create a little bit of design. So just select these faces and press I for the insert operation and use the loop tool and circle option and then create a little bit of design at there. And now you can see it's look pretty well. Then you can select this edge and then E to extrude it and move it along the X and Y axis. Just need to use the extrude operation on these edges. And then add a few loop cuts like this. I have added the file loop cuts and then control B and then add a bevel on these loop cuts. And now you need to select the faces. So just select these faces with the shift or select. So press E for the extrude operation and then scale it down like this. And then add a loop cuts at the bottom and now you need to add a 2 to loop cuts like this. And now you need to select these words right click connect vertex path and then select this edge loop and control x to dissolve it select these words and use the merging option merge at last. And select these words and double tap g for the edge slide. And now it's look good. Now just I need to add few more edge loops at there to maintain the form and to get a decent one. So just add the loop cuts like this to maintain that form. These are the supportive loop cuts. 
and now you can see it's look pretty well. So decent modeling we have done here. You can see its topology. In this way you can create this kind of models. So thanks for watching. If you like this tutorial then hit that like button and subscribe our YouTube channel. Bye bye. So next video take care.